All right, here we go. Oh, wait, what? Why? This is a good spawn. This is a pretty decent spawn. I hope that I can just like survive long enough to make it worth it. Some good wood right here. We got some, we got some decent wood here. I, I mean, I, first things first, obviously you gotta start picking up some rocks, right? Like that's, that's the smart thing to do. You gotta survive with them Rockies. What is that pillar in the sky over there? I don't know what that is over there. I'm kind of afraid to find out, but I mean the fact, is there a bed here? We got some seeds and everything here. There's a little flower. Aren't these like bad to live in? Dude, this is a great spawn. Okay, I just have to survive long enough to make it worth it. What is this? Is this a camp? What a spawn. This is the best spawn I've ever had on RL Craft. Oh, nope, nope, nope. This is where I die, chat. I'm gonna die. I'm actually gonna die right now. Is he still chasing me? He's still, he's still chasing me. Okay, there we go. My man's just beating the door down, dog. What? Why? Why? Why are you doing this, man? Don't beat the door down. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. <gasps> Bed. Sleeping bag. Dude. Let's go. In armor. You got to be joking right now, dude. This is clutch. I just have to make it worth it. I. I. I the problem is, is I don't think sleeping bags, uh, like hold your spawn. You know what I mean? Like I don't think you can hold a spawn with a sleeping bag. Oh, but we got bandages at the wazoo, dude. This is best case scenario right here. Ooh, this is a really good spawn. Is the zombie still alive in here? I think he died. Perfect. Okay. Let's drop a, let's drop a, uh, let's drop a sleeping bag here. I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything out of this, but what are, what do I need to do? I'm trying to remember what I need to do to start. Like what's some of the first things to do to start. I think it's to get like sticks, right? If I can get sticks out of here or it's Flint. And I'm sure a lot of you guys are like, oh my gosh, Connor's so dumb. Can't remember how to play. You're right. I am. I am dumb. I can't remember how to play. <laughs> I haven't played in a, in a very, very long time. I literally moved across the United States before I, the last time I played this. <laughs> Rock sticks, flint string. Oh, well, I guess it doesn't even matter when there's just an entire village over here that I can go raid. This is like, this is insane. This is the best case scenario. Oh my gosh. I love this. But the question is, if I can get a bed from this place, dude, chilling. We're set. Do I live here, chat? I think, I think living at the house nearby is good. I don't think living here would be smart. Okay, we need to be careful of those things because those things will clap my cheeks in a matter of two seconds. Did you see me? I don't know where he went. Excuse me, Arasaur. Okay, so we have some wheat here. I don't have enough requirements to use it though. Okay, yeah, I see some Aegis here. Okay, there we go. Hello, Aegis. Dope. Let's find a bed. No dragons though, so we're, that's, that's a good sign. Anything in here? Nothing in there. Bronze. Uh, Umbrium. Okay. Oh my gosh. Did I just find the craziest hay spawn ever? Oh my gosh. Gosh, I should be able to make bread out of this, right? Oh, this is literally the best spawn I've ever had in RL Craft. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, this is the best. I love this. Oh, look at all this food we're about to get, dude. We're gonna be set. The pr I need to I need to set my spawn though. Like I can have all this right now, and this is all good and dandy. But if I don't have a spawn point, I'm done. So I'm gonna eat that. I don't need those. Oh my gosh, we're at 63 slices of bread, dude. We're chilling on food. Bed. We're golden. Absolutely golden. Look at all this stuff we're getting. More healing salves, some plaster. I, I love this. I can't I can't set a spawn point though yet. It has to be nighttime. I could head back to the house, the starter house, and then use that as um like a good little starting point. That way I, I have a spawn at least. Dude, these Aegis are just all over the place, man. The sun's starting to go down. There's a brick dungeon over there. Okay, perfect. And it's turning nighttime. So I can I can drop my my house down or my my bed down and secure my home, dude. It's a pretty good day. I didn't pick up the bed. I'm gonna I'm gonna place my crafting table down. We're gonna clear all this out because this is gonna be my work area down here. I love this house, dude. It's the it's a much better house than I could ever build. Like I'm fine with it. We'll upgrade over time. Oh my gosh, this plate this mountain's catching on fire. Why is this on fire over here? What is going on over here? Why is all right, my, why couldn't it be a peaceful mode? Villagers talk now? They have dialogue? What? That's so sick. Okay, let's go place this torch in the house and then we'll head back to the village, grab the bed and come on. Oh, I'm thirsty. I need to, I need to get water in my house somehow. Okay, torch torch has been placed. We have a torch in the house. I have, I have water right here. Okay, perfect. So what? some of the first things I need to work on getting is like my flint knife uh, and I need to get a flint ax. I need to make an ax because once the ax is made and then I can make a pickaxe. And I, I just need to get those like basic tools in, those basic tools down, and then we should be we should be chilling from there. But I I mean the fact that we have a house and everything already, like makes my life ten times easier. And we have these pre-done torches, which is rad. Like this is literally the best spawn I've ever had 
in RL craft ever. I don't think I've ever had a better spawn than this one. We just got to make sure we can lock it down. Look, there's a whole nother tower over there. And our bed is actually, we're just going to go right here. Um, I can't sleep yet though. So bed has been placed. House has been lit. Our life is lit at this point. Let's get some more water and let's work on getting our basics. Let's get, let's get those, those basic tools down, which in terms of like basics, I need a flint, uh, I need a flint knife, right? I need flint tools. So to make a flint knife is a stick and a flint shard, but I need to get flint from some gravel. Is there any gravel in here that I can see? Oh, there's a creeper. No. Oh my gosh. I can't see anything in here, dude. Maybe it's not a good thing for me to be in here, but we got free cobblestone. So that's pretty pog. So now that I've, I've got four free cobblestone, if I can get a stick, I can make an ax and that just like accelerated our process. But I don't, I don't think I can get a stick from anything. How do I get sticks again? Dead bush in the desert for breaking leaves. Uh, okay, that's a good point. That's a good point. Chat just brought up a very good point. I could go to the desert, find a dead bush and beat that thing down and it should give me a stick. I'm terrified of the desert because desert beasts are like kind of insane. Is this a dungeon right here? This is a dungeon and he exposed and there's a building right here. So maybe there's something in the building that I can use. Let's go over to the building. I see some dead bushes over there. So we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna have to go beat some cheeks over. There's so, there's so many dungeons over here, dude. I love this. Lapis lazuli blocks. What does that do? I don't know what I just did. I pulled a lever. I hear zombies. More torches. Okay. I, I hear zombies below me. I, I I can only assume that that was supposed to be like a trap. Maybe. We just got some more free torches. That's what I'm talking about, baby. All right. So there's one of those stupid beastie boys. No, not like the artist people. Come on. Stick. Nice. Let's go, dude. Pog. Thanks, chat. That was super smart. That's a super smart move. Now let's head back to the house. I need to eat. That's why I'm walking so slow. Let's make some stuff with our crafting table and then we can start really, you know, oh, we gotta get some free berries. Literally getting fed everything that I need right now. I, this is, I, I normally, I'm dead like at least eight, nine times. <gasps> oh no, 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 not another one. Leave me alone, dude. Come on. I just wanna make it home. Just leave me alone. No, please, please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't do it. Please don't do it to me. Please don't do it to me. I just want to make it home. Please don't do it to me. Please don't. I just want to make it home. Please. I'm like right here. Oh my gosh. I just want to make it home. Leave me alone, please. I don't know if it's behind me still or not. I'm not turning around. I'm not looking until I'm in the house. Oh my God. Get me in my bed so I can sleep. Oh my gosh. Spawn point has been set. That was like true fear right there. I don't need this rose. Yay. Get that out of here. Gosh, and he's just hanging out outside my house now. Look at him. You better not, shouldn't be able to beat that door open. I don't have a weapon. I can't even make a weapon. Can I make a sword? Oh, I can. Why did I make a sword? I should have made an ax or a pickaxe. I can, I can make a pickaxe still or an ax still. Okay, the question is, is can he go through a, a one, a one block? You know what I mean? Oh, he hit me through the wall. Okay. No, they can't. Okay. But they can still hit me from that far. All right, cool. That's right. Get your cheeks slapped, son. What's up? What's up, son? I'm just better than you guys. What's up? We're chilling, bro. So now we've done that. We can break down these fences. We don't need these to be in here. I, I want to say that this is like a horse stall area or something for down here, which I can use these fences to build a perimeter around the, the house and so I can keep the place safe. I also am out of space. Uh, I can definitely use this plaster. So let's, let's heal up. Let's get my body all healed up and then I can pick up some fences. There we go. Perfect. So now I, now I can save these and start making like a perimeter for the house. I need, I have the ax. So I think I need to make some like storage systems, right? I think that'd be really smart for me to do is make some storage. Let's break down this tree. We're up to level two, which is pretty good. What, what do I need for a shield? Because a shield would be what, like that would save me a lot of heartache. Do I need to have any defense for shields? I need to have four defense for shields right? But not these shields. I don't need anything. But like what's, what would be good? Farming would be good for like food. Uh, I'll worry about that in a second. I, I, I'll come back to it. So now we have this. Let's place these guys down. Just going to use these to get some storage. Got some planks. There we go. Perfect. This is a great, great start. I'm, I'm vibing with this for sure. So now that we have this, I'm just going to make two chests for now, just so I can have some storage stuff. I'll worry about like transferring stuff later. What's up? So we've got pretty, we got pretty, oh yeah, I should get my defense up so that way I can put armor on. That's what I'm gonna build into. Yeah, cause armor, armor and stuff is so important. So, so far we have swords, we have, we have a home. We have, we have some pretty decent stuff set up here. We have a home, we have two 
I, I probably don't need this to be up here. I'll probably, I'll probably just put it away. I've got a lot of like armor and stuff. Put this away. I can't wear any of that right now. There we go. I should, I should close this up. That's what I should do. So I think next, next thing to do is to get like start working on cobblestone and stuff. That way I can have like my full set of tools and that I'm like, that I'm kind of set up for what I need. I need to get, I need to pick up pebbles. So let's go pick up some pebbles. Yeah, there's a castle. Come here, I need your XP. Come here. There we go. Got some cat or cop cobalt. Ooh, aloe vera. Interesting. Okay. How many pebbles? That's two. Okay. So there's one cobblestone. It's two cobblestone. Stay in the shade. Try and get our temperature down as much as we can. That's eight. So that's two cobblestone. Look at this. Boom. Pickaxe. That's what's up. And I got a heart crystal. I for you can do stuff with that, right? I think you can make a you can make you can get extra hearts with that. I'm pretty sure. That's how that works. Okay. So now we've used our stone pick. Now we have our stone pickaxe. We can start kind of cracking away at some stuff, getting some XP, get rocks out of this stuff, make some more cobblestones and stuff. Um, can I get, I can get coal and I get levels for coal. This is perfect. Coal's good too. Cause I, I what I need to do is make my furnace. So I can start making meat and start cooking up iron and getting all that stuff done. Um, and I think it'd be smart eventually to like really just go on a rampage with wood and just like, just bust down an entire forest. Oh my gosh, there's another one of you ding-dongs over there. You stay over there. Actually, you know what? Come after me. Let's do this thing. Come on. I need the XP. Bring it. Let's go. Come on. Hey, hey, come here. I need the XP. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Thank you. I need the XP. So now we can make... How many... Is that... Oh, that's not enough for a freaking... Gosh darn it. Okay, we're close though. Did that guy put some... Oh, he did. Oh, and it's turning nighttime. Okay, I do not want to... <laughs> I don't want to do anything at night like this. So I need to make a, a furnace. That's that's the last thing I need to do in order to be like set for in terms of like basics for RL craft. So I just seen a couple more of these guys. Okay, now we have 15. Furnace. Boom. Congratulations, everybody. We did it. We made a furnace. Cool. Um, so now we can cook up this crake meat. We're gonna toss some coal in there. We'll get some nice XP for that. Um, and so now what do we get XP from? I can't I think. Isn't it best to get XP from crafting or is it best to get XP from combat? I can't remember. I want to say combat, right? Because you, you hit, you kill a lot. You kill a lot of mobs and like the crazier mobs you kill, the higher XP you get. So yeah, it makes sense to get XP from mobs. I'd say this is a pretty decent start. Like I think I've got like really, really good items. Like uh, we got a house right off the bat. We've, we've had nothing but like positive survival things happen to us. We've had a couple close calls. Okay, a couple close calls for sure. No doubt about that, but I think it's a pretty decent start. I'm happy with that one for sure.